All right, praise God today. He has brought us back into his house. Before stand, stand before him out of the distractions of this world. And we want to welcome everybody here and, here and joining together with us online in this hot day up, up north here. Uh, praise God for bringing us all together once again here on Thursday. What's today's date? The 18th. Our Father has brought us together and give me a little bit of time. I gotta find the right book in my Bible on this tablet thing. <clears throat> All right, here we go. All right, welcome everybody here at Prayer and Breach Ministry. My name is Pastor Eddie Myers. We'll be teaching it. We have to get, welcome everybody here. All everyone that's come here to receive together along with us. Everyone that has come together to sit before our Father. And to, to learn everything that, that he has for us to learn. And uh, as we all, as we always say, praise, uh, I mean, uh, we're preparing to preach ministry. <laughs> that when we come together, we come together united as one. We come together uh, <clears throat> with no division, come together with no division, no, um, no, no nothing to, to, to uh, uh, cause any, any division or discord among uh, one another and we come together when we come together we come together united in one we come together ready to hear uh, ready to hear from our father the lessons that he has for us to receive on this day and, and as we as we all say that like, keep keep in prayer uh, the whole this whole time that we're together for his the word to come forth with no interruptions no disturbances for the broadcast to go forth over the internet, for all of the hungry that come in together with us, that, that we all pray and that, that uh, there be no interruptions along with that as well. And so as we, let, let's all, before we get started, let's all uh, bow our heads in, together, united in prayer. Dear Father, we thank you and we praise you, dear Lord. In the name of Jesus, dear Father, we thank you for being with us and, and guiding and keeping us and giving us another day. Dear Father, we thank you for all the joy that you've given to each and every one of us, the safety in our travels, surrounding us with your angels of protection, dear Father. And I pray, dear, dear Father, in the name of Jesus, dear Lord, as we come together, forgive us of all the sins that we've committed against you, dear, dear Father. Every, all the falling short that we've done, dear Lord, I pray, bring us back on our right pathway, dear Father, that there be none to fall away, none to, none to backslide, dear Lord, in the name of Jesus. And as we come together, as we come together in the name of Jesus, stand and guide and be with us, dear Father. Continue on blessing us in the name of Jesus, dear Father, that we all will be able to receive uh, and, and remind your children to be in continuous prayer for this word to come out, dear Father. No disturbances, no interruptions, no hindrances of the flesh. And there will be nothing to interfere with it going out upon, uh, going online, dear Father, as well. I pray, dear Father, to, uh, that... that, that that, that your spirit to be with us, dear Lord, in the name of Jesus, to giving us the interpretation of your word, dear Father, as we all need it, dear Lord, in the name of Jesus. I pray, dear Lord, in the name of Jesus, just to guide and keep and stand on with us, continue on blessing us, dear Father. I, 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 and I pray, dear Lord, <clears throat> just to guide and keep us, dear Father, and all of those that will be joining together with us, I pray safe travels upon them as well, dear Father, and dear, dear Father. We know that, that that your spirit is with us, dear Lord, at all times, guiding and keeping us, and 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 causing and giving us directions, dear Father. I pray in the name of Jesus that your Holy Spirit that dwells with us, dear Father, will open up the word, open up your word that you have prepared for us this day, dear Father. That your Holy Spirit will give us understanding, will give us the, the wisdom and knowledge, dear Father, that that we need for to receive this your word in our hearts, dear Father. In the name of Jesus, dear Father, I pray, is to guide and keep and stand on with us, dear Lord. In the name of Jesus, and Satan come against you. In the name of Jesus, you shall not have any. You shall not have, have nothing to do with this Bible study that our Father has allowed us to come together to to uh, to, to receive. In the name of Jesus, I cast you out. No, no, no sicknesses, no disturbances, no interference with the message going out online. I cast you out in the name of Jesus. Cast you out of all of the homes of those that are joining together with us online. I, uh, and and, I, and, and I pray uh, I, I put peace upon each 
and every one of the homes, each and every one of the uh, 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 hungry that join together with us and then I cast you out in the name of Jesus. You shall not have anything to do with this uh, Bible study that, that we all come together <coughs> uh, sitting before our Father for. And dear Lord, we we thank you and we praise you, dear Father. And I pray in the name of Jesus as you, as we receive this your word, dear Father. Remind all of your children in the name of Jesus, dear Father, that that it is it is you and only of you that this word comes, dear Father. That you get all the glory and praise and all the accolades, dear Father. That none would come into myself. That there, that that there may be no temptation of pride, dear Father, to enter into your servant in the name of Jesus. And I give myself, uh, I give myself to you, dear Father, in the name of Jesus. I, I, I crucify my flesh and empty my cup, dear Father. Praying in the name of Jesus, dear Father, that you will, <coughs> excuse me, that that you will uh, speak through me, dear Father. That you would give your word, that the, you that give your word that you would have all of us to receive, dear Father. Speak it through me. I pray, I pray, dear Father. Let there be no interference of the flesh to, in, to 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 hinder the word to come forth, dear Father. In Jesus' name, we thank you and we praise you, dear Father. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. <clears throat> Yay, Jesus. All right. Here we go. Last week, now we start, we're start. we starting on the, the, the struggle of two natures, that, like we did we, like we, as we started last week, the, the uh, battle between flesh and spirit, and, and, uh, and, and, it's, and it's a continuous of uh, Saul of the Old Testament and Saul of the New Testament, how each of them, uh, came in came uh, and two came, came to do God's service in different ways. Saw so the Old Testament being of the uh, when he started out being humble, uh, knowing knowing that he couldn't do it himself, and and then him uh, uh, being filled with with um, pride or. or, or uh, stubbornness, wanting to do everything his way, and, and to solve the New Testament, how he came in haughty, how he came in proud, uh, and knowing who he was, knowing uh, the uh, sitting at Gam Gamaliel's feet and learning from learning from him, being a, a, a Gamaliel being a high, one of the high, uh, one of the higher ups on the Sanhedrin council, and he and and he ended up being humble by God. He ended up doing God's service. And now here we're learning the, uh, the, the, that struggle of two natures that, that we are, that everyone has. Everyone that is saved has. That, that, that I'll say it like that because if you're not saved, you don't have a struggle. You're a slave to, to, to the flesh. You're a slave to what Satan would have, will, will, would have to do with you. When you and when you're saved, that that you have that struggle. That as we're going to learn, that you want to do the things that God, uh, that God has for you to do, but you still have that flesh part of you that wants to that 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 uh, wants to do what feels good. That that is easily corrupted by Satan and and his tactics and his snares and his traps. And now last week we learned that that uh, what, what Paul said here when he said uh, in Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't say what book and chapter. In Romans. We're up in Romans in chapter 14. Chapter 7, I'm sorry, chapter 7. And last week we started at verse 14, uh, where, where it says, For we know that the law is spiritual, but I am carnal, sold under sin. And we learned last week that, that the law is spiritual. The law is good because uh, <clears throat> how Christ said, whenever somebody came up to him, a uh, uh, and a certain, somebody came up to him and said, uh, "Good master." And Christ said, "There's none good but God." And and God gave the laws to Moses to give to the children of Israel, and and seeing that God is good, God is nothing but good. His law, the the law that He gave, is good, and and, and it's spirit, uh, spiritual in the sense that, uh, how is it that 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 how Christ said that God is a spirit, and those that worship Him must worship Him in spirit and in truth. That all of this, co all of this comes together. That the Lord, that that at, that God about uh, His character. That that God has no evil intent in Him. He has no uh, no no ill will. No 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 nothing that that anyone can say is bad. And that he, and that how Paul said that I am cardinal, sold under sin. How he is a, uh, how Paul is. 
he's he's there's still that flesh part of him and being sold under sin is uh it is whenever he um or all of or all of us that we're, when we're born that that we're born and uh in how is it father we're born in that corruption that Adam and Eve had and how Psalms chapter 51 was that chapter 51 5 says a shaped in iniquity let me let me see how that is turn over to Psalms what is that Psalms chapter 51 verse 5 and put a bookmark in Romans because we're gone we're going to be back at Romans I know you probably turn let's turn to Psalms then <laughs> Always keep a always keep your hand a bookmark and where we where we open up at. All right, now here in Psalms fifty one chapter fifty one verse five, I'm reading this out the King James. It says, "Behold, I was shaped in iniquity, and in sin my mother conceived me." And that was referring to to the fall of at that that Adam and Eve had. That everyone after them they, they were, is born in sin. Everyone after that is there's none. There was no one born that that is uh, free from the uh, how is it is free from the corruption that that came about through Adam and Eve, and that's what he's saying when he says sold under sin. He he was sold uh, not willingly, but but like well, like when a slave is sold <clears throat> into in, in, into slavery, that that slave has no has no um control with no no how is it the slave doesn't want to be a slave but he has no control of they have no control over it. and then and so they're forced in it and that's the same way what paul is talking about he has no choice but to to have that uh sin upon him because of what happened in the in, in the beginning with adam and eve and now here in uh, verse 15, back at, turn back to Romans now, and we're going to come on, and we're going to start here at verse 15. And I'm going to read this out the King James. Now here, verse 15 says, "For what, <clears throat> for that which I do, I allow not. For what I would." that do I not but what I hate that I do now that, that sounds a little confusing but the Lord the, the, pray that the Lord will uh, clear it up for us now he's saying for, for that which I do not and he's speaking of of, uh, of, of the flesh He's speaking how how things happen um, during with, with with the flesh that that uh, he's saying that that um, that w that which I do that the things the the fleshly part of him the the, the anger that he may feel or, or the the um, straying of the mind that he may that he may uh, that he may uh, do the, the 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 things of the flesh. And the, and this is this is not saying that that um, that he always that that he was a uh, how was it that he was a bad person before because he was a in in um where is that at in uh in Phil in Philippians that he he was a straight Philippians chapter three verse five we went over this uh, before. That in Philippians chapter three verse chapter three verse five, it's, it, he gives he he gives a uh, 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 what, what oh man what did I say? Oh no, I got the wrong. I wrote down the wrong one. Ah uh, man, I wrote down the wrong verse. I'm sorry. That he he's uh he's he he's going on his like his um what is that father his his credentials 
of uh, of how he uh, of who he was. That he was saying that he's a Hebrew of Hebrews. His parents were both Hebrews, and 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 he goes on and says, uh, as as for touching, as for touching the law, a Pharisee, that he that that he was strict. His his uh. That, that the Pharisees were strict in, in how they saw the law and the rituals and everything like that that that, that he he was he was um how would it, how would it be put father that that back then in the old he was following after God with everything that he had in in the the, the written form and, and doing the work to in doing the work to follow after God. So that's what we're saying that when he says what I what for that for that which I do I allow not. And <clears throat> this is the flesh the, the the fleshly the the the, the uh, flesh part of him. That it, and going on down in turn uh stay back at uh Romans chapter 7 our focus. That going on down in verse 21 that that he says uh I find I find then a law that when that when I would do good, evil was present with me. That there's always a uh, that, that there's a, Satan is always going to uh, is going to be after everyone that has accepted Christ as a personal savior. Everyone that walks with God, it says that evil is present with me. It, it's not coming after him. It's it's not uh, seeking him. But it, it it's that 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 part that flesh part is always it's always battling it's always a uh how's it it's always coming after him to try to uh satan is always coming after him to try to cause him to fall away satan is always coming after us to, to do the same thing to turn our eyes away from the lord to go the straight narrow path that god has us put on trying to make us go either to the right or to the left away from where God would have us to or how God would have us to, 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 to walk whether that be uh, the weaknesses in our flesh or whether it be uh, uh, somebody trying Satan trying to discourage us in in a, in, uh, a certain way that that everything that he wants to do he says that that with everything that the things that he does, he he allows not. The how um, like when you're at a doctor's office, and I I don't think they do that anymore. Like whenever they tell you to cross your legs and and they check your reflexes with the, uh, uh, with that rubber hammer, and they hit you like right be, right below your knee, and your reflex it, 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 it and, and your reflexes uh it your leg automatically kicks out even no matter how hard you try not to do it when he hits that nerve your leg automatically <clears throat> kicks out that's the same thing with walking in the flesh that's the same or not walking in the flesh that's the same thing with the battle of the flesh that we all have that there's a uh, certain time that, that there's that certain time where something happens and and sometimes we might uh do something out of reflex or how or or uh, before we were before uh, we were saved, how we used to conduct ourselves, how we used to act or talk, or or, or uh, uh, the things that we used to do, uh, the, the 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 flesh tries to come back to that. But those things that that he would do that he he does not want to do. The things uh, uh like like in um where it says in where it says in uh let's see in in in, in Genesis. In Genesis chapter six, where is that? Chapter six, verse five. Let me make sure I got that one down right now. And uh, let's see, get to it. Turn over to, to to Genesis chapter chapter six, verse five. And I'm gonna read this out the King James, not the King James, the NIV. It says the the Lord saw how great the wickedness of the human race had become on earth and that every inclination of of the thoughts of the human heart was evil all the time <clears throat> and this this is what we this is what Paul battles against this is what we all battle against the the, the uh the struggle of the two natures the 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 things that how we said that the things that 
uh, the the flesh wants to do, the thing that the the how's it for the, the the pleasures that the flesh wants, uh, that that is uh, it's a continuous battle, and sometimes that we do, that sometimes we might slip up and and do things that we that 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 uh that we didn't want to do, and this is what Paul is saying here. Back at back at Romans, he's saying for for that which I do, I allow not. That it's a that that battle sometimes slips up. And uh, go ahead, turn back to Romans. That battle sometimes he he slips up at, and and he goes on and saying. Oh wait, where are we? Oh, 15. I almost went down a verse too far. It says for what I would do. I do not. His desire. Our desire, everyone that, that has accepted Christ as a personal Savior, the desire uh, should be to, to run after God. Your, your whole breath should be wanting to go after God. It, it should be like wanting to breathe. Uh, like, like the Lord has told us uh, one other time, that, that every inhale should be like prayer, and every exhale should be... Uh, should be like praise. That that's how that's how uh, we all should be toward t uh, our attitude toward God. Just the continued desire to do to do the things that God would have us to do. The desire to the the, the desire to run after Him. The desire to uh, just to, to to form your whole life around uh, around God. And this is what Paul, this is what Paul is, is what I what I would do that I do not that it, it's a struggle that that it, it's not saying that what he would do he doesn't do like he he like him saying I want to follow after God but I don't do it he he he's he why he's following and he runs after God but it's not uh, he he still has that 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 uh, struggle with him he still has that uh. <clears throat> He still has to fight on, just like everyone else. We still have to fight on with, with walking with God, because uh, just like the the uh, before we went over, he says that which I do, that which I do, I allow not the things that the things that we sometimes do that we don't uh, that that it's the, the the flesh that sometimes flashes quick before whether it be whether we do it physically or whether it's our thoughts or, or whether uh, or whether it's our uh, a, a, a desire, that's all. That's all the battle. Uh, that's all the, the the battle between flesh and spirit. That <clears throat> that the Lord that the the Lord. I mean, Christ said to his to, to his disciples when he told them to pray, and they fell asleep. I believe it was Garden of uh, was it Geth Gethsemane. But uh, but he, when he told them to pray, they fell asleep, and he said, uh, "The flesh is willing, no, the spirit is willing, but the flesh is weak. That their flesh, that they, 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 that we're not, we're not at a point to where everything we do is unencumbered, not being not being interfered with." by the flesh and that that's not going to happen until we uh, until we go to heaven or until christ comes back and 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 take what's <clears throat> and, and take back this world uh that 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 satan is ha, has is trying to settle in right now it's always that that work in progress just like in uh now let's try this time in philippians let's see if i got this one right philippians chapter 12 chapter 3 verse Verse twelve. Oh, whew. I thought it was. I thought I put down chapter twelve. <laughs> Let's see. It, it, now keep a bookmark in uh, back at Romans. Don't lose your place. Now Philippians chapter three verse twelve is saying that not as though I had, not as though I had already attained, either. It, uh, already attained, either were already perfect. But I follow after, if that I may apprehend that for which I also am apprehend, apprehended of Christ Jesus. 
And I'll read, and I'm gonna read this out the uh if I can get this tablet working right. I'm gonna read this out the in the the, the uh, NIV. Uh what did I say? Philippians Philippians chapter three verse verse twelve. Now at the NIV it says, not that I have already obtained all this or have already arrived at my goal, but I press on I press on to take hold of that which Christ Jesus told me took hold of me. That 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 he him, Paul and, and and none of us have have, have arrived at the point to where, where where Christ is at the 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 no more the uh how's it father the the that freedom from sin the freedom from uh that that battle of of, of flesh and spirit that we that as long as we walk here on earth as long as we are here that that battle between flesh and spirit is going to continue on no matter how no matter uh, how hard we run after God, and, and we and and we should we and we should be running after God continuously, and and with with everything that we have on on ourselves, our our heart, soul, our strength, our mind, everything should be running after God full force. But there's still that 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 uh <clears throat> that battle that goes on that we have that we have that we uh have. And, and and that and we're not going to fully fully obtain the uh fully obtain the the, the the where we want to be that 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 walking without the hindrance of the flesh upon us and that's what this time that's what Paul is talking about turn back to uh Romans where he says for what I would for what I would that I do not that he wants to continuously. That's why, and what we just read in Philippians, that he's that he's following after to 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 be able. How's it said in 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 NIV? It says uh, he presses on to take hold of that for which Christ Jesus took hold of. He's pressing on for it. He's pressing on. He's running that 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 race continuously. It's not it, just as we. The Lord has said before in church that is it's not a sprint. It's not uh, like a hundred yard dash. It, it's like a, a, a ultra marathon. That it, it's it's it, it's not going to. It, there's no there's there's no short route to it. There's no short. There, there's no there, there's no shortcut to it. There's no. It's not a short run. It's it's a long. Uh, it's a long run that, that that takes endurance, that takes patience, that takes uh, that, that 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 faith. Being able to to uh, count upon count on the Lord to do everything that he that that he would do for that that he uh, that he that we want that we desire for him to do for us. That it, and it's a it's a not it's a never ending battle between. Our flesh and our spirit, and he's and that's why Paul, why we say Paul saying that, I, I would, what I would, what I would that I do not. And he goes on and further says, but that I hate, but but what I hate, I'm back at Romans, but what I hate that I do. He says he's saying this twice, just to let him know that. The things that the, the, the things that are upon him, the things that sometimes enter into his head, that sometimes the things that the, the, that that uh, maybe that he does uh, 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 of the flesh that that's he, he doesn't want to do those things. He doesn't want to. He doesn't desire to go out and and uh, have vengeful thoughts. But maybe sometimes it, it, that he did. Of all uh, of all the uh, uh, the. People that came against him, the 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 people the uh, people that he once uh, were friends with were now enemies. The people that he once that once uh, he helped or helped him are now looking to do him harm. The people that he once stood by are standing against him. <clears throat> 
and it'll be hard and, and, and it would be hard to no and, and back then it was uh only by word of mouth but i'm pretty sure word of mouth can't went by uh pretty quickly back then yes word of mouth people telling each other like something happening in school and you telling your friend and your friend telling somebody else and that friend telling somebody else that's word of mouth but all of these people that come against him all of these people that talk that 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 are probably talking bad about him that are probably uh trying to plan things against him to hurt him it, uh, probably some it, it probably sometimes angers him with, with uh might anger him sometimes when, when he slips up or, or when the flesh interferes with it with, with him and that's why he's saying that it says but but what I hate that I do he doesn't desire to do it he doesn't uh, <clears throat> he doesn't want to do it he, he doesn't he, there's nothing in him that wants to live by the flesh there's nothing in him that want that wants to live uh, of the way in the way of the world. Nothing in him that wants to uh, be pleasing to anything to anything that 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 is of the world. And that's how this the the, the same thing that that we that we are to uh, how we're to put, how we are to conduct ourselves as well. That we're not to uh, look and desire things uh, 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 of of the world, how to how the world would have things, uh, whether it be uh, clothes or or, or uh, homes or, or cars or uh, how is it or, or anything that pertains uh, that that that's in that's that is in the world. That we're we're in the world, but we're not of the world, or else I should say that anything that is of the world, because that 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 because we walk here in the world, but but we don't, but we're not of the world. And when I say we're not of the world, we're, we're we don't live uh, how the world would live, like the the, the strong will survive. Uh, 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 do uh, when somebody does something to you, you take vengeance take revenge upon them or, or or do something to them before they can do it to you or or living or or just how anything any way that the world looks the policies of, of the world and and how the world does things that that we're we're not to do the things that way we're to walk with god in in, in prayer whenever whenever we have uh, have a need of something we're to pray for it we're not to look uh, uh, to ourself for anything we're not to uh to, to turn to our own resources that we can think of think of uh we're, we're to we're, we're to turn to god whenever we want to do something whenever we uh we, yeah want to do something or or whenever we need something we uh should be asking uh, praying and asking the lord uh to provide for us <clears throat> but here Back at back at Romans that in chapter I mean verse sixteen. In verse sixteen it says, If then I do excuse me, if then I do which I would not, I consent that the law is good. Now it's in it yeah, oh, I thought you had a question. He's saying that if he uh, if he does anything that the that uh that the world would I mean, if he does anything, wait, then what well, is it? If then I do that which I would not, if he if he does something of the flesh, uh, something that that's not that that's that's a, uh, against God or, or contrary to God or against God or not pleasing to 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 to, to our Father, that then he says he can sense that the law is good because the law when 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 we looked at the law. Here, well, here back in uh, uh, Deuteronomy, Deut Deuteronomy chapter chapter thirty. 
verse 19. Let's see if I can find that. Where is that at? Deuteronomy chapter 30, verse 19, and I'm going to read this out to uh, New King James. It says, This day I call the heavens and earth as witnesses against you, that I have set before you life and death, blessings and curses. Now choose life that that you that you and your children may live the laws all of the statutes that he put that 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 uh god put before them to follow uh the the restrictions everything they they're allowed to eat they weren't allowed to eat everything all the land that they were supposed to uh take over and and, and conquer that all of these that he that he does them, he he's telling them that he says I, I'm setting. He sets he sets before them, life and death. It, it's not it, like like with, with all of us with all of us with salvation. That it's not forced upon us. We don't. It, it's not something that we have to do. And that's and off subject a, a little bit for a second. That that that's something wrong. That what. Uh, a lot of parents do with with, with children. They they force them to be saved. They they for or, or children or loved ones or or siblings or who whoever it may be that somebody a love in your life force that that's not saved. They force them to be saved. They force them to uh. <clears throat> they force them to uh, accept Christ as a personal savior. That they say you have to be saved. You have to accept Christ as a as a personal savior. And they're not doing it out of uh, uh, a lot of well I'll say a lot of times it's not being done out of selfish out of selfishness uh, a lot a, a, a lot don't know other ways how to do it they, 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 they either have not been taught or, or have not received the teaching that to be an example to be the uh, uh, to, 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 to let them see to let the other person see how God blesses them in, in, in that in, in their life in that way how God uh, teaches them and how God uh, takes them on and shows them the and shows them the way and and here we see in Deuteronomy and and was that chapter 30 verse 19 that that God sets before them God gives them that choice the same way God gives us a choice that God uh, like how God uh, gave us that choice whether to accept Christ as a personal savior or not to that how Christ said that many are called but few are chosen that it that, that he calls he, he calls for everyone he wants everyone to accept to, to be saved he wanted here in Deuteronomy he wanted everyone to uh, listen to his instructions and to um, and, and, and to obey him and to walk in the way that he that that he has for him, but he's it's nothing that's going to be forced. That there it's nothing that that's going to uh, be like you have to do this this way. He, just like he says here in Deuteronomy Deut Deuteron <laughs> Deuteronomy chapter thirty verse nine nineteen. He says, I have set before you like a, 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 a tray of, of food, like a tray of food to a, 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 a hungry person. He's not forcing it, forcing it on them. He's not uh, saying that they have to eat of it. it, it he's, he's not wedging, it's not, uh, you're not wedging their mouth open and forcing food down there. Uh, you're not pushing them on, it, it, just like with salvation. You're not push. He's not pushing salvation on us. He's letting us know. He, he, just like anybody that reads the Bible, he, he's letting them know uh, the two choices that they are: whether to walk and walk and uh, walk free, or or to uh, <clears throat> or to serve the, or to serve Satan and and, and, and what he and, and the uh, things that he has for you to do. God said uh, uh, we're in um 
Romans. What is that chapter? We're on chapter seven, verse sixteen. That he said he set. He, we're going over Deuteronomy right now. Deuteronomy chapter thirty, verse nineteen. But we're coming from Romans. But he set before them life and death. He sets before us the same thing: life and life and death. A choice that we all have to make. A, a, a choice that we all have to. Uh, that that we all have before us. And it, like like the Lord said, it's not it's not forced upon us. It's it's not. He doesn't say you have to do this. He just sets it before us. And it's like He says, life and death and blessings and cursing. He tells them the 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 benefit. He tells them what He's going to do for them if they choose to walk with Him. He tells them what what's going to happen if they choose if if they choose not to walk with Him. It's it, it's all the. Uh, a choice they have to make. Now go ahead and turn back to uh, uh, Romans. Oh, yeah, in verse 16 it says, But if I do that, if I if I do that which I would not, I consent the law is good. That if he goes against the law, if he goes against what God has put out there, that he, that, that he's saying, that what he says, um, and that, that he, that, that he's saying, that he's, um, admitting that that this law that the law is good that it's it's not uh it's not the 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 law that is faulty it's not the law that has a a mistake in it, it it's our it's our it's uh within ourselves it's, it, it's our flesh like like uh we went over before in the beginning that with, with Adam and Eve that there was the choice that they made and be, and because of the of the choice that they made they uh <clears throat> excuse me they have to um they cause that that corruption they cause that curse to fall upon each and every one of us and now he and, and now that that what we just went over that what he what what he does that he doesn't want to do or what he yeah, what he does, it's something that he does not want to do, but what he wants to do, he does not do, because, and this is all because of the, um, of the, uh, flesh, the corruption that's upon him. And, uh, and now here, going on down to verse 17, Romans, Romans 7, Romans 7, 17, it says, Now then, it is no more I that do it, but sin that dwelleth in me. All of these things, the, the things that he would not do, that he does not want to do, the, the things that he does, oh, oh, oh man, let me tell you, let me take my time. The things that he does, but does not want to do. It's, it, it, it's, it's what's in him already. That, that corruption that, that's in us all, already. The, the things that uh, living... The, the battle that we have, uh, that we have, the, everyone that's walking with, that walks with Christ, everyone that is uh, is saved, the battle that that we continuously have to uh, not to do, uh, not to live by the way by the flesh, but to live by uh, by by God and, and what God would have us to do. It says it, it, it says uh, that that. Not that I what oh seventeen, not that not then now then, it is no more I that do it but sin that dwelleth in me. Turn to um, where is that at? For here first turn to Second Corinthians, Second Corinthians chapter five, verse uh, seventeen. Let's see, make sure it's the one I want it. There we go. Let me read this out to King James. Now here is in Second Corinthians chapter five, verse seventeen. It says, "Therefore, if any man be in Christ, he is a new creature. Old things are passed away, and all things are become new." And uh, and now turn to verse. I mean, turn to a uh, First John, chapter three. First John chapter three verse nine. 
and that says whosoever is born of God doeth not commit sin for his seed remaineth in him and he cannot sin because he is born of God now back what we just read is is that that um, it then no it, it's no more now back at Romans chapter 17 chapter 5 chapter 7 verse 17 that Paul saying that now then it is no more I that doeth but sin that dwelleth in me salvation when we accept Christ as a personal savior salvation is that that new creature that new heart that God gives us the new spirit that that the, the, the revived spirit that, that God gives us that that uh, filling in that void and and, and here in first uh, John where, where it says uh, what we just read where is it at in verse 9 it says uh, born uh, who, whoever is born in God do, do it don't com doesn't commit sin and, and he cannot commit sin because he's born of God that's the spirit that's within us the the um, the spirit that the 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 spirit that that tries to come out of us. This is the uh, the the saved side. The 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 um the the the, the other part of that that of the nature. The 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 spirit that wants to walk with God. That how we 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 read it um in verse what was that in verse five that that uh uh that that where Paul said. I mean, verse 15, Romans 17, 7, 15, where Paul said that he goes after uh, Christ to do everything that he wants him to do. When well, we read that in Philippians, what was that? In Philippians chapter, chapter 3, verse 12. That God, that, that uh, his whole nature, it's just like we, we, the Lord went over before his whole nature to do everything what God would have him to do. His breath, that, that he, he wants God as bad as he wants, uh, as he wants his next breath. He wants God as bad as, he, uh, that, that he wants, work, work, he wants God, he wants to walk with God, uh, worse than anything else. That there's nothing, there's nothing more, in, there's nothing that, uh, in this world that he wants more than to walk with God and, and he's and, and what we just read is, is that uh <clears throat> is that that who, what we just read in uh what is that first John and, and and Corinthians that being a new creature and and the not sinning that, that anyone that is in God is not does not commit sin that's that spirit that's within it, the Holy Spirit that, that's trying to, um, the Holy Spirit that, that desires to fill our hearts and, and fill our lives with, with the life, with, with uh, uh, the, 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 how is it, with the life that God would have us to live. That here in Romans that he says that it's no more him. That he, that his whole his whole desire is to walk with God. It's no more him. And, and he's not a, he's not um, excusing himself of, of something that happened, and like if he smacks, happens to smack somebody, backhand someone, he says, "Look, that wasn't me. That was because I want to walk with God. That was that wasn't me that smacked you." But but, but he's <laughs> but he but he's saying that his desire is to walk with God. His his the thing that the, the things that happen isn't what he wants to do. It's that sin that that's already in him. That sin that that uh uh that that that's that he's fighting against and he's not going to he's not going to do something and say oh uh, the, 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 the devil made me do it I didn't want to do that uh, but but what he's saying is that his whole this whole desire that he has his whole reason for for living his whole reason for being is to walk with God and we're going to stop there but uh, but but what he what he's saying all through this what we just went over now is that th there's two there's two natures within it there, there's that the the uh flesh and there's a spirit there's the things that that the flesh wants to do the and and always keep in mind this is what we're we're talking about everyone that that, ha that has already accept Christ as a personal savior that there's that 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 uh desire that the part of us that that wants us that wants 
desires to run after God, desires to do everything that God would have us to do, desires to uh, uh, please Him. And then there's a, that other nature that that's when a, that that's battling against uh, uh against us. Where is that? Let me. See. That that's battling against us. That wants to uh, uh do the things that 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 wants to live the way the world wanted to, live, the way the world lives. How how the world uh the uh, the survival of the fittest uh counting upon yourself to do things uh, uh not not uh not bowing down to anybody and, and things like that. These two natures are always going to battle against each other. But here, what we just went over is that Paul, his whole desire is to walk after God. His whole desire is, is to do what God would have him to do. Just like in how the Lord said, just like the, the next, the, his breath, the breaths that he take. That's how bad he wants to. Uh, that's how bad he wants to run after God. And that's the same thing with that. Same thing. Same way with us. The next breath that we take uh, should be our, our our desire to breathe should be equal. Uh, our desire to walk with God should be equal to an even greater and even more than uh, our desire to uh, want to take our next breath. And that's what and that's what he's talking about. That that he that uh everything that he that that might go on in his life, everything that he might do is is not. Or some some things that he might do is not what he wants to do. It's not what he what he's desiring to do. But he wants to. His desire is to walk with God. His desire is to uh, obtain uh, uh, obtain the the total uh, total defeat of the flesh that 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 is that 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 he's battling it battling against. All right, and now we'll stop there. Stop there and start up next was that next week at verse eighteen. Eighteen on, I don't know. Just study on keep on studying eighteen down to verse was that twenty five, I guess. I guess that's what the Lord's gonna take us. So is there any questions? None, nothing to be said. Everybody's quiet, so I guess um, I guess everybody understands what the Lord is telling us today. And now here, coming up the inv invitation of disciples. If there's anyone out there that desires to accept Christ as their personal Savior, everybody, anyone out there, anyone out there that that wants to uh, uh, give their life to the Lord, that there's no uh, long ritual that you have to go through. There's no uh, long speeches that you have to remember. All it is is, is that when in your heart. Or within yourself or out loud, all you have to say is, is, is say, Jesus, save me. <clears throat> Excuse me. I know, I know I'm a sinner, and I know I need to be saved. And I ask you to come into my heart and save me, to be the leader of my life as I, as I go on. And, and that's all that needs to be said. Uh, if the Lord puts something else upon your heart to say, you say it. If not, that... that all it is is that you accepting Christ as your personal Savior. You want uh, uh, you uh, no, uh, acknowledge that you are a sinner, that you know you need to be saved, and that and that your desire is wanting Christ to come into your heart. And that's all that needs to be said. And that, that there's no probationary period that you have to go through. There there's no uh, a long year long rituals or or no classes that you have to take. Uh, to complete your salvation, once you accept Christ in your heart, that's all that it takes. So if you do, if you want to accept Christ as your personal Savior, all that needs to be said is within your heart or out loud to say, Jesus, come into my heart, save me. I know I'm a sinner, and I know I need to be saved, and I, I desire you to be my Savior, to 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 uh, come in and save me. And then right after, once you do that, once you accept Christ as your personal Savior, pray. Pray and ask the Lord what church he, uh, to send you to a church that, that will strengthen, that will uh, help you in your walk with, with, with Him. Because there, there's always a church that God has for us. <clears throat> a, a group that can come together and help strengthen you in, in, in the church. And, and, a group of, of saved, of saved people.
And we welcome you to come on back to join us here online. Online, but but there's a. a it, it, sometimes people need a. They, they, you need a group to strengthen you, to help you along your way, to help you with your walk whenever you feel. Uh, uh, you're about to slip up that that you need somebody to, that you need somebody there to to encourage you on and that's what a church is going to do for you but when you pray and you ask the lord that when when you get done praying you pr you end your prayer in the name of jesus you and it'll be complete but but uh like i said if you desire to accept christ as your personal savior you just what we went over, uh, asking the Lord, asking Christ, Jesus into your heart, accepting Him as your personal Savior, uh, admitting that you're a sinner and that you need to be saved, that, and that, and reminding you that that's all that needs to be said, nothing else. And if there's any prayer, uh, any prayer requests, uh, you can email them in to us. Our, our, our uh, email address is at the bottom beneath the video. It's prayer at rtbministries.us that's prayer at rtbministries.us you email them in and, and we'll get and we'll pray get started praying on them right away <clears throat> but what we thank you for joining together with us and we and we welcome you to join us uh, on set on sunday at 12 we'll start our broadcast at 12 30 uh here on Ustream, and if you desire to join together with us in person, that, that our, we come together in uh, Holiday and Express. Off the Elizabethtown Reams exit, off of 283, we welcome you to come on in that, that <clears throat> come on in and join together with us to, to uh, praise God with us and, and to sit before Him and, re and receive His Word along with us. But uh, if not, we're join together with us here on Ustream. We'll start, we'll, like we said, start our broadcast at 12, uh, 12.30. If there's nothing else to be need to be said or no questions, let's all bow our heads and be and, and to be dismissed out. Dear Father, we thank you and we praise you, dear Lord, for being with us and guiding and keeping and standing on with us, dear Lord. We thank you, dear Father, for allowing us to come together, dear Father, in the name of Jesus, dear Lord, for allowing us to hear your word, dear Father. And we thank you for uh, uh, breaking down your word for us, dear Father, for the understanding and the, and the need that we have, dear Father. And I pray to you in the name of Jesus as we continue on and finish out this week. I pray, dear Father, to be with us and guide and keep and stand on with us, dear Father. Give us direction, dear Lord. Protect us and keep us free from all hurt, harm, and danger, dear Father. There be no dangers uh, or obstructions to fall upon any of us, dear Father. Your presence be upon the homes and the vehicles and, and, and the families. Be that cornerstone, dear Father. In the name of Jesus, dear Lord, keep us free from all dangerous situations, dear Father. Guide and keep and, and be with us, dear Lord, and, and bless us, dear Father. And let, I pray, dear Lord, that the world not uh, take away anything that you have given us, dear Father, and, and, and the word that you have given us, dear Father, that it will settle in upon our hearts and bring forth good fruit into our lives, dear Father. In Jesus' name, we thank you and we praise you, dear Father, for all that you've done and all that you're going to do for us, dear Father. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen.